without question one of the most thrilling games of the Sean Payton Drew Brees era of victory that was reminiscent of games during the 2009 Super Bowl season. The Saints victorious here in the Mercedes-Benz Superdome on Sunday afternoon. They defeat the Washington Redskins in overtime 34 to 31. Yeah Fletcher they came in red hot into this game seven game winning streak and earlier in the week Sean Payton told his team don't buy into the hype. You know what they did early on. They they looked sloppy and the Redskins were just hitting on all cylinders. They were up by 15 points with just over three minutes left in the ball game. But that's when Drew Brees took over. He did not throw an incomplete pass on the final two drives. The Saints score twice with less than three minutes to play and they convert a miracle two point conversion to force overtime and in overtime Will Lutz plays hero the game winner sending the Houdat Nation into a frenzy. I've been saying it, you know, every every one of these games is a confident booster. Um, our coach told us, you know, we hadn't been in a close game yet, and we'd love, he'd love to see how we responded. Um, clearly, you know, going fourth quarter in, we're down by 15 points. That's, that's hard to overcome in this league, and not only did we come overcome it, we, we made it one of our strengths. A game like this, we're going to grow and become stronger from and, and gain more confidence from versus last week, you know, where you go on the road and tough environment and all that, and you win 47 to 10 where you weren't really – you know, challenged like we were today, you know, at the end of the game where, you know, obviously everybody's got to be on their A game. And so this is one that, man, you, we, we, we grew today. We got better today. When you have wins like this, you, you it's, the, it's the number one thing you'll miss when, when you're finished playing or finished coaching is, you know, the, the excitement of, you know, getting one maybe that didn't think, you, you know, you were going to get. All season long, the narrative for this team has been the ground game and the defense getting the job done. But in this game, a new storyline from a very, I mean, very familiar face. That's right. Drew Brees has been telling us all season that he and his team haven't played a perfect game, and they weren't perfect against the Redskins, but Drew Brees was perfect at the end of the game. On the final two drives, two touchdowns and a two-point conversion, and in overtime, Drew Brees went 11 for 11 with two touchdown passes. Drew was great all the time, but those situations, I think he, I, I think he lives for those, you know. I mean, he, he was locked in Zone, zoned in, uh, and he just he just made it happen. I mean, it's magic. Like, it's magic. <laughs> so now, it's only natural to compare the 2017 Saints to some of the greatest Saints teams of the Sean Payton Drew Brees era. The 2011 team that rattled off eight consecutive victories, and of course, the 2009 Super Bowl 44 championship team that opened up 13-0. Yeah, Fletcher, four players remaining from that Super Bowl team. While Drew Brees says it's unfair to make comparisons to former teams, he thinks this group of guys can be very special. You're watching this thing come together before your eyes, you know, and from where this started to where it is now, and we've grown in leaps and bounds, and I think the sky's the limit for this group, you know. Um, we're playing with a ton of confidence, you know, feel like we got a ton of momentum. You win games like this and you feel like, man, we can win anywhere, anytime, any way. All right, the Saints will hit the road to L.A. to take on the Rams, and if they can take care of business, it will be nine straight wins, joining the 2019 that, of course, Went on to win 13 straight games, Fletcher. That's right. That would be a tremendous winning streak. The Rams did lose on Sunday. They fell to a very good Minnesota Vikings team, so they are now 8-3 and three overall. But this is still going to be a heavyweight battle in the NFC. For Sharif Ishak, I'm Fletcher Mackle, WDSU News.